have been seeing really ever since uh, Barack Obama first won election in late 2008, a growth in groups uh, on the radical right. In 2008, we went from about 150 uh, so-called patriot groups, anti-government uh, radical groups, uh, to something like 1,360 groups in 2012. In the last year, though, uh, Donald Trump has added fuel to that fire in a very big way. Al Gore and George Bush and people like and Mitt Romney and these people, they're all the same. You know, they're all the same type of candidates. So it's it's pretty interesting this year to see something a little bit different. So. You know, we, we support those nationalist principles like closing the borders and things of that nature. So uh, we do support those things, but we're not going to come out and endorse them. Donald Trump wants to bring back jobs to America. Give dignity to the American worker. It's not that Trump is telling these groups what to think. Uh, they uh, have, you know, had their own white supremacist ideology for many decades now. What Trump is doing is legitimizing. I came here to speak on behalf of Donald Trump. I've never met the man, but I can tell that he has nothing but the best interest of this country at heart. Some of the things that he's saying are issues that we've been tackling for years now. We talk about globalism, we talk about America first, uh, these sort of things, bringing back American jobs. These are things that, that he's hitting on, so it's, it's put a lot of our uh, nationalism sort of becoming mainstream. All we want is to change America back to what it was. We, we do want to see whites, you know, rise and have, have uh, uh, our own state here in this country. I do think that Trump will probably help the movement grow as a whole. We may not see that reflected at rallies, but I think we will see it reflected on the number of people who are engaging uh, with the ideas of the white supremacist movement, whether that's electronically on the internet or in actual person in face-to-face -face encounters. I mean, we are uh, all across the country going to be uh, watching the polling places. Where we have chapters, where we have members, we're going to be uh, unofficially monitoring those polls in different parts of the country.